Has this ever happened to you? Slide a little romantic movie in, you know, okay. get All a nice right. squanchy in later All on, right. you know what I'm right. saying? Just as you were putting down your best Mac Daddy moves with candlelight and soft music one Brent, all huh? of a sudden Brent, one question what's and up do not lie who what? the fuck are these these are, these, these are yours no motherfucker fuck you are, are you, you trying to play me nah bro that's what you gonna do that's when you need to call us at whose panties are these cleaning service well who the hell called you and what we do is find stuff that women leave behind that men simply can't find man i got a little girl for a little man i Y'all gonna find it in my room, nothing in my bath. My bathroom is clean. Even oh, my farts are clean. I'm a vegetarian. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, we got made that smell good. Uh, see, it got to be Where did all that stuff come from? It's got to be. The bathroom is clean. Yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, her so pretty. Oh. She looks just like you. Uh, I mean, oh, a baby? Who left a baby at my house? We did it again. They don't ever think we gonna find that bullshit. But we do. Another, Another successful, successful day. day. Wow. Thanks, whose panties are these cleaning service? Operators are now standing by to find the hidden panties in your house. Y'all was watching House Party and stuff? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like, I was, I was really in tune with the culture. You know what I'm saying? You knew about Fresh Prince? Fresh Prince, I was raised by Fresh Prince. You thought, okay, okay. So that was like y'all's, how, okay, oh, I guess to, to me, how I grew up, built, that was the Cosby show and all that. Even though I was young and it was like some older stuff, it was like respected, you know what I'm saying? It was like, eh, it was like kind of a little generation or two behind, you know what I'm saying, ahead of me, but it was, res I respected all of that, you, you know what I'm saying? Show? I grew up with that, just how you said. Would you vouch for it now, even, even what's happening post? Kind Would of, you, you know? vouch for the Fresh Prince of Bel Air? Oh, if, if 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 somebody, I mean, I'm not trying to throw shade on nobody, but I'm just saying every there are scandals and skeletons everywhere. <laughs> so, and if <laughs> I'm just being dead, oh, ass, man, like yes. yeah, <laughs> man, you you Google the Fresh Prince uh, scandals, they got all they had two mamas, nigga. <laughs> yeah, you're, you're right. One, I mean, you're two right. and Vibs. You're right. It's the, the the first half, and now shout out to both of them. They did a great job, but the first half be hot still. Yeah, she's still hot about that, dog. She in the theater. She got like real emotions. She know how to exert her her expressions. You feel what I'm saying? So I mean, if you if I'm just saying, there's some kind of scandal somewhere. I'm not trying to shade nobody from the producers <laughs> to the actors to everybody. Probably the cameraman that did some shady shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> but if you know about any of that, does it affect how you feel about? The wow. Fresh Prince of Bel Air. When you found out if they if somebody told you, oh, one of the producers was involved with a sexual assault or or you know what I'm saying, like some scandalous, nasty, smelly case on him, and you like, <gasps> but he the producer of the whole show and put a whole little cloud on top of the show, raining little just dirty ass rain on top of the show. Now, like, if you would you still stand for it or would you be like, nah, that's my culture though. I grew up on it. Uh, I mean. I mean, I I personally feel as if I, I like the Cosby Show. <laughs> no, don't, don't talk about that. Get back on that Fresh Prince. <laughs> I like the Cosby Show. You know what I'm saying? I still rock with it. Post whatever. Uh -huh. uh, I still rock with Bill I, I, and Will. Uh -huh. Bill and Will. Right. They gener generational people, revolutionaries. Okay, so you okay? I'm I'm just you see I'm just fucking with you, but you get it. You get yeah. it, man. Uh, and that's I think that's what's dope about it all, man. Uh, the something that like damn as me as a kid as i grow up as younger people growing up and they like nah we rocked with it too though we you know we something i always tell old, older or people my age i would say as y'all call us older heads whatever like i'd be like nah we we those are our little brothers bro. We, we fuck with them yo they fuck with us just because they y'all rap or y'all dance or y'all might move a certain way or dress a certain way it ain't all hate it ain't all get out of here um you know what i'm saying like it's respect definitely you know that's definitely, all definitely respect what do you think about eddie murphy making a comeback oh eddie murphy is the biggest inspiration um, on me honestly like growing up people hit me with the eddie murphy it's, you look like Eddie Murphy, you know what I'm saying? You could like, play Eddie Murphy now, I look at it, dog. Young Eddie Murphy. Yeah, dog, damn. Like that live, you know what I'm saying? 
But I think I think it's dope. I, I watched Dolomite as soon as it came out, you know. What's your favorite Eddie Murphy movie? Favorite all time. Hmm, there's so many, but I'll probably have to go Harlem Nights. Do you know about Harlan? Oh, yeah, 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 you're a cool young cat. You're a cool young cat. See, I, I can see, man. That's how, that's how you the ladies, man. You know what I'm saying? I can see. That's, ladies, peep that. You want to get you a dude that, that know everything, you know what I'm saying, that know all kind of different forms. That's why I was always able to move around and, and be cool and be, you know what I'm saying? I know that. I know, I know how dirty you are. I know that weapon, bro. Like, it's a cold little thing. You got a little knowledge of everything. You can, you can fuck with everybody. You can talk to everybody. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, it's the mustache. It comes and, and you got it. And you got it. Okay. It's the but you know about the you keep a you just you stupid guy. Like, you keep a '90s mustache for no reason. Don't know twenty year old rock a '90s mustache. Yeah, I gotta do it. Too. But uh, I ain't mad at you. Do you think Eddie's gonna do? How you think he's gonna do with his stand up though? Oh, uh, I think it's needed for the culture. I think I think he did it right. He he made it. He did his two. It was out the game, and he hit him hard. You know what I'm saying? And I feel like him coming back. Is showing his other side. He showed his youthful, youthful side. Now it's time to see the father's Ooh. side of Eddie. You know. Ooh, I never thought about it like that. We about to see an old Eddie. Yeah, it's the first time. Mm -hmm. I mean, not the first time. We've seen it through acting, but like this is a different point in his life. Ooh, do you think he's gonna come out and blow everybody like away? Like, or do you think? Like, what do you? What do you? What is your expectations? I'll say that. I think he's still gonna show he's talented. I don't think it's gonna be like raw. He's already apologizing for the things that he's saying, you know what I'm saying? So, like, I think I think it's going to be, I think it's going to be his first Bill Cosby special. Ooh. Now, as a comedian, when you say that, when I hear that, I think that this could be, that means this could be better than Rock. That means this next Eddie could be better than Rock. Because be. when you say to Bill Cosby, I know everybody throws shots at Bill Cosby. Bill Cosby, in my opinion, was is the greatest living comedian alive. And I know, hey, man, he's, he's, he's a hot button. You know what I'm saying? But just off his work. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Just off that man's work, that's the greatest comedian alive. And maybe probably the greatest comedian ever did it, man. Like, I know everybody throw the whole Richard Pryor thing. Mm -hmm. I'd say Bill Cosby. I, me personally, I think Bill Cosby had a greater impact. Yeah. I, I think he, you he know. He sleep on all the shows that he put out there. Fat Albert. What is man? He had cartoons. <laughs> you know what I'm saying, bro? Like yeah. they, they, on people clothes on their jeans. You remember what he put it on people denim? Man, but, back uh, pockets. You stupid. <laughs> I don't think he's responsible for platinum fubu. You stupid, dog. <laughs> I do not think Bill Cosby's responsible for that. He probably had a check, he but I don't, think, a he's, check. He I don't think it was his idea. <laughs> I think he hated it. <laughs> <laughs> but you're right, man. Cosby was so influential. Yeah, you know, like Cosby was in colleges. That's mm -hmm. he's Doctor Cosby, mm -hmm. uh, and that's off his work in comedy. It's not mm -hmm. off him being a student. That's literally just off of the work that he's put out in his work in, in comedy. I don't know, especially too many African American, uh, maybe Dick Gregory type, but and I, I'm just through that as a shot. I don't know that for a fact, but mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure. Man, that's, that's hard, man. Like, you know, like, if he not the only one, I'm pretty sure ain't no, you know, not too many out there. Like, when you can do that, bro, like, he's mm -hmm. Dr. Cosby just off Dr. his work. Dr. Cosby, yeah. And it's not just his TV shows and cartoons. He got movies, you know what I'm saying? A lot of stuff that was before, shit, even before my time. Like, there's a lot of stuff. I didn't, I never, I didn't see all that I Spy shit he did. And I think he did some shit with Sidney Poitier. And You're talking about Bill Eddie? Bill Cosby, oh. man. Bill Cosby. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Like, he did movies. Mm -hmm. He had, like, a... Bill Cosby had a whole career a lot of us forgotten about. Like, a whole generation just forgotten about. He he gets no love for it. Like, he gets so much... It's like, it, it's so bad he's sleeping in the cot right now. And, it, man, it's so bad right he's in now. jail right now, dog. That's how Last bad night. society... <laughs> and I guess, you know, I'm crazy. not one of the people that be like, oh, he did it to himself. I, I don't know a man's business, bro. I really don't, and I, it, it is what it is. I, you know what I'm saying? I don't know the dude's bit. I just know somebody's work. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? I, I try to be like that. When that's the best objective way, is that the word to be about it? You know, it's like like football. Like, why we watch sports and stuff, you know? Like, yeah, I just like Jordan, dude. You know, yeah. I just like Iverson. I like Kobe. Like, and you get all into all people to people, bro. But yeah. you go for his work. He, yeah, Bill Cosby is. Might be the Jordan MJ or the the goat. Mm -hmm. 
My my two favorite all time are Eddie Murphy, and Martin Lawrence. Those are the people. Okay, I'm glad Chris you said. Tucker. I'm glad you said three. Martin Lawrence. Let's yeah. talk about Mr. Lawrence, yo. Mr. Lawrence. <laughs> what the fuck happened to Martin Lawrence? Man, Big Mama. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck happened to Martin Lawrence, dog? Let's just talk about that. Like, damn. What did? Okay, what did you see? I, and, at the big mama. It was like he was yeah. here though. You know what I'm talking about? Like he was here. Martin was my favorite comic too. Nobody mm-hmm. was fucking with Martin, dog. Yeah. And then like he, after Big Mama, you know what? I'm going to rep- I, you Big know Mama what? too. I, I say he wasn't the same after Life. Life, but Life was a great movie. He but he wasn't movie. great in it. What? You don't think he was great yeah, in Life? Name a memorable Martin moment from Life, nigga. Name one, nigga Martin. When he was, when he was on the, the when actual he was words, the, when not he was the things he was the, doing. The words, the, the chairs. It, it was hot. It, no, you don't like that. that That's scene. a quote. I'm, I mean, it's a memorable scene. No, tell me a Eddie. quote. I would quote Friday, dog. Four, of them, all three of them, however many Fridays it is. You can quote, uh, you know what I'm saying? Somebody, you can quote Eddie in the movie. You can quote uh, Bernie Mac in the movie. I mean, the, the way I don't know, but I, he was he was a pivotal piece. I feel you could. Uh, you you feel like you could put somebody else in there? Yeah. Who? A- a- anybody. And they probably would have been just... Name one person. I mean, it probably would have been hilarious if you would have put Chris Tucker. You could have put D.L. Hughley in you there. Put, you could have put Chris Tucker up in there, too. You could have put D.L. Hughley in there. You could have put Earthquake yeah. in there. You could have put uh, Bruce Bruce in there. <laughs> you put it in. Martin didn't do... I-